This well-kept corner home on this quiet Glenwood street is surrounded in police tape. Officers came to the house this afternoon after getting an ominous call. We received a call from a man this afternoon around 3.30 p.m. who stated that he had killed his son and his wife. Glenwood's chief says police arrived to find the resident in the garage bleeding from apparent self-inflicted cuts. Police were all out front and uh, saw them bring out the uh, father out of the garage and uh, put him in the ambulance. Inside the home, a woman believed to be his wife and a man believed to be her son dead on the second floor. Neighbors say she was always outside watering her flowers. They describe her husband as a good neighbor times that I was around them, very good people, both of them, very good people. Seem to be a pretty happy couple. Any prior calls to this house that yeah, you we've know? Had, we've had calls there, but uh, I couldn't give you uh, the nature of those calls because I haven't read that report. The chief would not say how he believed the two victims died, except to add that it was a bloody crime scene. The man who was taken to the hospital had cuts on his arm and on his neck. But the investigation continues. We are live in Glenwood. Dana Kozlov, CBS2 News. Robin Erica. Okay, Dana, thank you.